Does anyone know why elephants have such wide ears? Big ears help the elephants hear better, right? Actually, no. Um, they have big ears for other reasons. They are mainly used to keep the elephants cool. That makes sense. I've seen elephants flap their ears before. I guess the ears are like their own personal fan. Exactly. Raise your hand if you know why ducks have one feet. Their webbed feet help them to swim faster. That's right. Their feet are designed in a way that allows them to walk on land and swim in water. Please take out your science notebook. We have a very important definition to write down. Mr. Payne, my notebook is in my locker. May I go get it? Go quickly and tomorrow make sure you come to class prepared, Stella. Stella. The feet of ducks and the ears of elephants are samples for adaptations. Write this definition in your notebook. An adaptation is a physical trait like a Design body part or a behavior that helps an animal species to survive. Can I draw a picture of an elephant's big ears and a duck's webbed feet to help me? To remember and understand this definition. Excellent idea, Gabby. Draw an arrow from your sketch to the word physical tray through. Those are most examples of a physical adaptation. What should we draw as an example of an be before adaptation? Let's figure out this together. Be behavior, behavior, refers to how an animal behaves or actions can you think for something a certain animal does that helps it survive. I know hibernates, hibernate, may, many animals like bears hibernate in the winter. It helps them 
survive until spring when they will find more food. That is Example, go ahead and draw a quick sketch of a bear hibernating. As the week continues, we will learn many more interesting examples of animals' adaptations.